Last night we were sailing all night and early this morning the ship pulled into Grand Cayman Island and anchored offshore. Hi Leonard. Just fine? How are you doing? Just fine. Now the wind's going to hit the speaker here a little bit. Oh. Zoom in here to see what's going on that's on shore there. A lot of little shops we went to. I'll be going up to the front of the boat here in a minute. Grand Cayman Island. Only about 40 feet in height is any of its highest point. Sunken ship there. Beaches and seven miles of beach down that whole shoreline. This is from the front of the ship. Passenger cruiser pulled in and anchored also. The New Amsterdam. That's on that side. Across our deck, on the other side, is the Skyward, which was with us at the last stop at Cozumel. Here, Grand Cayman Island. Down there is a boat that you can see. There are people swimming in the water, snorkeling. They're looking at coral and fish and other marine life that's here in the ocean. In the background is Grand Cayman chomping the old part which is right down by the sea. Grand Cayman was noted for his turtles and seamen used to stop here and pick up fresh turtle to have on board the ship for eating as they sailed back across the Atlantic. This is looking to the south now. And there's the skyward. It's kind of bright over there. I'm standing in the observation deck of the ship. shuttled out that's the shuttle boat there heading over to the Norwegian cruise line this port isn't deep enough for the ships to go all the way up to shore in Jamaica we'll be going all the way up to shore as you can see it's kind of windy out Flags are really, really blowing. On board, they're busy. They're doing repainting, scraping, refinishing the varnish. Just doing major repair when they're in port. This is a lifeboat here along this whole side. Come back here, you can see there. Doing the same thing. Cayman. Most of those buildings you see are banks. Just like in Switzerland, this is a place where people can have numbered accounts and hide their money. There to have 400 banks. There go the snorkel boats in. And that's still Grand Cayman. Skyward over there. The far beach. Again, here in Grand Cayman. A lot of people go ashore and walk the beach. 
That's her main hotel area. There are a lot of taxi cab drivers in town asked us if we wanted to go sh down to the beach. This is George getting ready to sunbathe. We're on the sun deck. There's not many people on the sun deck right now. Most people are on shore. This is quite a small pool. There is an indoor pool. And the larger ones on the other side. And it's filled with teenagers today. He's wetting down. Salt water. Ah, the ocean. Can you blow us a kiss? How about a kiss? <laughs> Thanks. Woo! <laughs> okay, turning around over here. We have a ship called Contiki. It looks like a floating restaurant. And it's also known as a glass bottom boat. And it's just now turning around over a different coral reef. And maybe they see different kinds. They float on the water for three hours. And it's called an endless bottom of the Rome Swizzle party. They must have a good time. <laughs> Get that they don't seem to go out too far from shore, do they? There must be coral reefs under this entire section. Well, a steward will lay out a nighty from several of the other passengers on board. And this is Wanda's nighty, all laid out so nicely by the steward this evening. Two pieces of candy upon the pillow. While I'm at it, I might as well view the rest of the cabin here. That's a bunk there that will lay down into a, another one in case there's some kids along on the, the door and step out into the hall so I can... There's our little dresser and sink unit. And in here is uh, the shower and, and the stool. This is a side hall off the main hall. The door is going closed here. So you can see the size of the room here. There's a closet right behind the door that I'm holding open. Night. Tonight we're having snails. Let's kind of go. And that's what snails. Oh, they look good. They're that's what. Make you get that. As I told you. I thought I better get some tomato juice to have this. Aren't you going to feel bad if they turn back? George. Now, George. now yeah, I'm, I'm going to take a bite of these in just a minute here. We'll see what they look like. Now remember, these are snails. <laughs> Only get your chin. <laughs> oh, zoom, zoom, use the zoom lens. Back it up a little bit. Alright, have you backed it up some now? Okay, there's your snail. Are you in focus now? <laughs> yeah. There's a snail, okay? Go ahead. Here's George eating it. Down it's all oh, here. He's still standing. He's sitting. Hey! Hooray! Hey, George. Another one. We'll try a second one then. See if he falls over. Oh, yeah. Not at all. <laughs> it's French night. All the waiters have their French caps on. There's Mark. There's George, our waiter there. He serves a big table of eight and two smaller tables. Hello, Mal. How are you? Good, how are you? Having a good time today? Good. Nothing. 